I get the heavy, like the Luperderm lotion. That lasts all night yeah. and shit. That's so mm-hmm. good. Bro, so, so you met I Show Speed. You beat him in a game of horse already. Yeah, kicked his ass. <laughs> I don't think he made a shot. Yeah, I don't think he did. Have you ever used something like Zoom and when you're recording a meeting, you see that it doesn't really look very good? Well, Riverside fixed it either. Nah, Stick to sports you where you use your feet, bro. Just the ball is touching your feet. Everything else, just leave it to. Bro, I'm better than you in basketball, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I am. I'm just not trying, you know, because because you being calm right now. But if I was, bro, I like like I said, I used to be a five star, five star college, five, five star basketball person when I was in high school. I was a five star like prospect athlete when I was in high school. Word. Where? Word. Yeah, word in Ohio. Oh, word. Yep. And uh, why didn't you pursue that? Because I started doing YouTube. Oh. Uh-huh. Yeah, you see? Okay. Hey, so on the jet over here, we are talking about your ankles. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bro, they were saying that we got the same ankles. I was like, what? No, no, no that's crazy. That's, that's sir, true. that's, that's not true is, at all. That's your speed. That's, that's not what that's happened. That, that, that's exactly what you did. No, oh, my shit's not, not, not that bad. <laughs> oh, oh, let's see. No, see, no, I was in nah, Cleveland. Nah, 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 see, when you go to Ohio, that's when your, your, your skin just... It's cold, ain't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, it gets yeah, pale yeah, and cold. Yeah. You throw on the lotion and it's still just Hey, hey we absorbed. know we're both from Ohio. That's exactly. In the winter, it. not oh kidding, bro. If I, don't, if I don't put lotion on my hands, I'm they sorry. will crack and bleed. I used to have to put petroleum jelly on my hands and sleep with socks on. No, I never yeah. did that, but... Yeah, yeah, no, no, that's, that's weird. Yeah. It's weird. But you what a stupid... Cleveland? Huh? No, I'm from Cincinnati, Ohio. Oh, Down okay. south Ohio. Like I've been there before. You read it? <laughs> It's like the worst. What's funny? Why are you only laughing? for a Bengal game? I mean, what else you go to Cincinnati for besides? Oh, Chili, Chili. Red's game. Oh, Chili. Red. Chili. 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 Skyline. Go. Oh, go start Gold Chili. Star. Yeah, yeah. You got right at? No, I was there in and out, bro. Chili. Oh yeah. Well, they put their chili on top of spaghetti there. Yes. Yeah. Yes. How do you know that? That's Middle of the country. I'm a food guy. Yeah. yeah. Is it good? Yeah. It's yeah. It's like a Cincinnati tradition. Like no other city, no other country nut does it. It's called a chili hot dog. You know, they put cheese, chili, and a hot dog, and they put it in a bun, and you like eat it. I swear you could get that elsewhere. I mean, that's, uh, you said nope. on spaghetti, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, like spaghetti, like no flavor spaghetti. <laughs> Put chili on top of it and cheese. And then a hot dog? No, 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 no. Oh. It's just a three-way. It's called a three-way. That's you nasty. Like, yeah. No, it's not. You got to try it. This is a perfect segue yeah. to you to your reasons why you're single. That was, this is, no, 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 no. <laughs> I swear, Katie, I swear to you. I swear to you. A, no, I you swear to I you. I really wrote that down? Oh, this is, you didn't you, write this? You were trolling? Bro, I didn't. That was a fake account. Bro. I am way too player to write some shit down like that. But is any of it but is any of it remotely true though? Hell no. So why are you single? Because I don't want a girlfriend. That's Just it. that, simply put. Yeah. I think that's why we broke up. I have my moments where <laughs> I, I wanna... think that's why we broke up, bro. <laughs> we men, we got our moments of times where I want I feel like you out. got your heart broken one time. Heartbroken? Really, yeah. Nah, 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 bro. I did too. I feel like you got your heart broken one time <laughs> and that just really fucked you up. I wouldn't say I had my heart broken. I've uh, I, I started to understand women a little bit more as I got well early on. I understood that like sh- she's not mine, even if she may be my girlfriend. She she might be influenced by other people. No. KD, you're you're selling yourself short of the people. greatest energy in this world that is love. So I mean, I he's right, but I bro, don't trip speak- on that relationship. If we having a good time for a moment, then cool. If we if you end up venturing off and I do too, it is what it is. But, but don't you know anybody that's that's been like married for like decades? Yeah. I what know some people that? that are married for a couple of weeks. <laughs> yeah, but you're focusing too much on those people. I'm focusing on everything. When you go onto the court, do you manifest that you're the best on the court? Manifest? Or do you do you believe it? Like do you truly believe that you're the best out there? I just do my job. You're not giving me anything here. I really do, man. <laughs> because I believe if you believe that love was out there for you, you'd find it. I You're a great guy. I'm You're the nicest guy in the NBA. I'm not. <laughs> See, you think I really actually made that list. I didn't. Well, I didn't yeah, why, why did we get that intel? No, no, because he he shared it. And that it was believed. I did not share that, though. Wait, Dylan, t- what's it's, going on here? It's, yeah, Someone it's, made it's it? A, uh, oh, oh, it's, oh, it's a Photoshop. Yeah. Like someone photoshop. Uh, yeah, somebody Photoshop. Uh, and, to make you look. Yeah. Soft. Like those NBA like parody accounts and shit. Yeah. Oh, so let's blame Dylan then. You want to? Yeah, yeah. Bad context. I, I always blame Dylan. All right, so we'll blame. Like, no, it's your fault. I don't care what you're saying. It's your fault. Yeah. But you thought I made that too? Everyone did. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It went viral. People really thought it was. Hey, isn't, oh, hey, isn't, that, isn't gosh, that fucked fake up? Fake news can circulate that fast. Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Yeah. Did you not see all the Ryan Garcia stuff lately? 
Are you not tapped in all of them? I have seen a lot of that. Have, yeah, have yeah. you seen it? Yes. <laughs> That's are. not him? No, it's him. No, it is, but oh, he said see? there's going to be, he said the other day that there's going to be an earthquake in Los Angeles. <laughs> <laughs> no I mean, shit, Everybody dog. can predict no, that. Yeah, no it's shit. It's probably one every day. Yeah, legit. <laughs> legit, bro. Hey, you just got to find the right girl, man. <laughs> Come on, bro. Stop talking to me like I need advice on It's whatever. No, 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 no. Yeah. Trust, yeah. Me, trust me, trust me. He got his heart broken <laughs> once. No, I, I should be just like him. I should be just like him. like bro. See, every time I explain my stance to people, they say shit like that. I get no, it, no, bro. You just been hurt, or you just, <laughs> bro. I enjoy spending time with. It's just, it's just not as long as maybe you like to spend time with people, mm. man. Bro, that Two one days for me is cool. But that one I'm, hand won't last, bro, forever, bro. You need something that's. Gonna, you, you don't need no. I'm bro, now. I'm gonna argue 16, on his side. <laughs> Can I compare yourself to me and you? Sixteen, bro. You have no other resource but your hand. So please don't put me in the same, you know what I mean, tier as you when it comes to that. You know what I'm saying? You're right. You're not even. You are a youngster. No, I'm not. No, I'm 19. But I mean, hey, but you ain't had no, no, no. I had a little something, but I still your your hand will always be there for you. Come on, bro. Stop. <laughs> I, 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 just, I know I shouldn't even dap you up. <laughs> Talk about your hand, bro. Hey, speed, you crazy, bro. <laughs> this is I'm. I've been had uh, a couple of days with you at length now. You you are wild, bro. Wow. He asked me why I was laughing <laughs> when he said something before. He, when he says anything, I just laugh, bro. For yeah. some reason, yeah, like what's delivery? The it's your delivery. You're funny, bro. You're just funny. You're a funny dude. Okay. I mean it. I think you're trying to be funny now. Bro. I'm not trying. <laughs> I'm literally just sitting here. I'm just sitting here. What you mean? Like All I'm just. Right. I'm just saying. You got any kids? No. What's well, the mean? only reason I ask is because uh, I have a kid. I can get him a way. girl. Or, I have a kid on the way. Congrats, bro. Thank you. Really? Thank you, bro. Yeah. Yeah. You it, dead ass. Yeah, but it hasn't broke yet. It. It. This is actually my first time saying anything publicly. Or? Yeah. What? Yeah, but I'll have announced it by the time this podcast is out. So if you guys are hearing this, keep that on the DL. What? Do you know it's a boy or girl yet? We don't know. Are you going to do the whole uh, gender reveal shit? Yeah. I seen some How long did it take ass? you, though? Yeah, we weren't even trying. Oh, you was just doing it? Yeah. Yeah. What kind of question is that? No, because, it's just, because sometimes it takes people. <laughs> That's mad personal, bro. You're right. <laughs> That's some 19-year-old shit. <laughs> <laughs> it is crazy. You're, you are so young, Speed. I'm not young, bro. I'm I'm like... As I get older, like every day, I feel like I'm getting older and older, you know? Yeah, well, that makes sense. Obviously. I think all of us probably. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Durant. <laughs> Kevin Durant. You know, I got all your, like, bro, like, I got all your shoes, like, KD7s, KD8s, K like, bro. Bro, get off my. <laughs> <laughs> that ass, bro. <laughs> Yo. I'm not trying to hear that right now, bro. We yeah. having a solid combo. Okay, all right. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. That was, bro. Yeah, that was a curveball. Yo, KD, this is also one of Speed's first podcasts that he's ever done. <laughs> yeah. Too, and you're making them feel hella uncomfortable. Don't you stream every day? Yeah, but it's different. Podcast you don't, is like you don't interview, you don't talk to people on your stream. Yeah, I do. Is it is, is it? Are you competing with other streamers, or, or do y'all have like beef within the stream? No, I feel like nah. <laughs> I feel like I'm to a point like there's there's like levels of streaming, you know. Oh, you on a different level? <laughs> I'm not. No, nah, I'm not. Yo, you want to know? The, he's part of the big three. They got just That's like hip hop streamers yeah. got a big three. You, Kai, who else? Aiden. Aiden. Mm. Aiden. Nickelodeon was kid everything, but that marked one of the darkest chapters. These are three. Yeah, it's kind of like, so it's like, like, yeah, like we're all like, like we all drive each other, but I want, it's kind of like you and like fucking LeBron or something. No, I get it. Like it's not It's beat, like friendly, it's just, like you want to like, uh, exactly. you want to just be, just be, be just as good as. Yeah, exactly. Or, or so, you know what I mean? You just want to stay on that elite level. I get mm -hmm. it. Yeah, exactly. They push me, I push them, you know, it's like a vice versa. Yeah, I feel that, bro. Who's the who's the big three in the NBA right now in your eyes? Don't just say just big me. Is that what you're gonna say? <laughs> no, nah, hell no. Nah. I mean, if you would look at it, you could say LeBron, Steph, myself. I mean, it's I mean it's, the NBA is different, bro. I ain't no big threes. Right. It's like a big thirty. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We all got our different especially now. Everybody got their own brands and shit. It's a lot moving in the league. But the three oldest that's still like playing at a high level is probably me, Bron, and Steph. So that's probably Kawhi. It's like PG. It's like a lot of guys, bro. It's hard to it, just put three in there. It's harder to be that good for that long. Like longevity in any sport yeah. is is like the toughest thing. You've been so good for so long. Do you love basketball? Like, how do you keep doing it? I think just care, like energy, man. When I come into the gym, I just really if I feel like I felt when I was a kid coming in here, bro. Mm. You see, I came in here and just picked the ball up, start shooting. Yeah. That shit just. I enjoy seeing the ball go through the rim. Do you love basketball? Of course. 
a lot of the other shit I don't like around it, you know, like the media and sometimes and the fame. Like this shit. This shit. <laughs> like this bullshit. <laughs> I like y'all. Yo, back, yo. You, <laughs> Why the hell was he always saying that? All right, no, no he's no, not. You got your leg cocked up. <laughs> nah, cause I, no, I was like literally. Gazing in my eye. Yeah, Come you on, were, bro. you were gazing. No, cause. Like, this is, really, for real, back up from off. <laughs> I'm just like, this is like beautiful. Like, I'm here nah, like, I'm talking. for real, bro, lean up or something, bro, cause just, you <laughs> But yeah, but I, I mean, I love it. I, I love the lifestyle, though, man. I love this shit, bro. You're the captain of the Olympic team. I won't say the captain, but I'm a vet. That's what they're saying. I'm a vet. That's vet crazy, man. man. Yeah, bro. Been at this shit since I was around here, 18. How long are you gonna do it? I don't know, man. That's a good question. That's a good question. I mean, right now I still feel good. I mean, I'm 35, about to be 36 next season. So, but. It's this shit is a young man's game too. Well, I was gonna ask, physically, you know, age has gotta be catching up to you at some point. Yeah, I mean, it will, you, it will. You got crazy recovery methods? No, nah, not too crazy. No ice bath? I do that sometimes yeah. here and there. I get stretched a lot. How do you handle stress? No, stretched. 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 How do you handle stretch? <laughs> <laughs> Like two hour stretch, like real, like real shit. Real shit. Were you doing that before <laughs> the Achilles injury? Um, a, a little bit. I just had started doing some of that stuff, right? Before the Achilles was crazy. Crazy. What was the What was the recovery like from that? Because that was such a serious Nutty. injury. It was like seven hundred days until I really felt like me again in the court. <sighs> it's that bad, huh? It's a serious. Yeah, because you gotta realize, like, you just it's like pulling the so a plug out the out the socket when you oh, take when man. you split your Achilles. Oh. And you lose some of that power that you had before in your calf oh, muscle. Shit. So you got to build your calf That's muscle crazy. already, and then you get atrophy when your calf gets smaller because you haven't moved it for three or four months. Yeah. So you just got to build that calf back up. Are they equal strength now? Uh, so they'll, they'll never be. Not. So how 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 do you compensate for that? Because obviously, if you're not equal on both sides, you're more susceptible to. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you what, what you lack in one side, you, your body just naturally just yeah. balances you out, but. Do you have anything else on your body right now that like you're taking extra care of? Or like nah, I mean I got I had some injuries. Now I had to, I had like an MCL injury. I had like a fucking I got a screw in my foot. Ooh, Dude, I have horrible <clears throat> arthritis in my right ankle, and they want to do fusion on it. They want to take the ankle joint out and just fuse the leg to the bone at a right yeah. angle, like a club foot. I've seen that. Yeah, I've, I've heard of that. I don't really want to do it because I don't want to have a right angle. As do a, you wake up sore? I'm I'm in ten out of ten pain every day. <laughs> it's a war every every day. You take bro. you take like painkillers and shit. No, nah, I can't because I used to do heroin. I got a question. Why your uh, phone crap? I could drop it, bro. Oh, you dropped it. I got another one at the house though. You know you don't just want to transfer your shit sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is, yeah, nah. is your phone naked? You have a case on it. I got a case. Oh, I, 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 I just put it on there because it's cracked. Uh, so when I FaceTime though somebody they can't really see me. Right. Know? But fuck it. It's you, working. You like the ocean? You like you got like a connection to that? Oh, you see that boat back there? Oh, that's a yacht. Oh. Is that yours? No, no, no. Is that the goal? That's a bad investment. Horrible. It's a yacht. Boat. Yacht, yacht. It's thing. not a bad investment. You can you can have people rent it. It's still bad. That's dude. work. You know what they what yeah, boat stands for? Charter. Break out another thousand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what they say about. They said the two, the only two days you're happy about a boat is the day you buy it and the day you sell it. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Unless you spend in seven months out the year on it, which Bezos, Bezos does type that. shit. Mm -hmm. Geffen. I don't even, I don't even think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Geffen for sure. Geffen's guy is crazy. His boat is stupid. Crazy. You ever been on it? No. Nah. That's when the Illuminati rumors start. Usually, the yachts are like the last step. Yeah, you go on the wrong boat. You're. I mean, you might as well be in the Illuminati. Just be what, careful. Just be careful what boat. Explain you to me. What, I've been hearing about this word for so long. Oh, I, we can't explain. Oh, we can't explain. We, we, other than we get accused of being in it. Yeah. Well, he does, not me, because of my shoes. It's almost like you want to be accused of. That shows. Like it, I think it. Word. Yeah, I think it. It means in you a way like you made. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but I. Yeah, as far as I know, I haven't been approached by any like black cloak people or like. You never. I'm did. wait. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the conversation. At which point, like I, I promise, I'll share it with you guys. Like I'm. Yeah. I heard it's the white party, the Ruben's white party. Oh. <laughs> I'm serious. I heard it, when you go in there, they audit. They have like a desk, like one of those desks where you sign, <laughs> sign in. Yeah, I'm serious with like clipboards and shit. Ruben, he wants to go. <laughs> no, no, he wants no. To go to the party. Mike is upset. He doesn't get the invite. Me, pff, I'm never getting invited to that shit, bro. They don't want me there. Come on. That's like reverse psychology. You trying to <laughs> yeah, please invite me, Mr. Ruben. <laughs> he was at WrestleMania. He was. I saw him talking to your brother. Yeah, yeah. Ask him some weird questions. 
Are you gonna do more of that shit? Dude, I think I'm gonna pursue. Well, not no, yeah, yeah, not I think. Like, I'm are gonna, you gonna sign with them? I'm gonna do. I I did sign. Yeah. Oh, you did sign. Yeah, I did sign. I'm I'm like. What's yeah. those deals? What those deals look like? Like, what's what's your? Uh, uh, I I want to say healthy, but compared to your deals, I don't know. <laughs> oh, bro, that's a billion dollar corporation, isn't it? They got money. Multi. They got money. It's a fantastic job. I will say that. What WWE? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. What's the other one? AEW. AEW is the other one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but I'm gonna do it, bro. I, I, I think I could become champ if I just put my mind to it and commit. Oh yeah, easily. I like it. But the Rock, the Rock came back last night. Rock came back last night. John yeah. Cena, Undertaker. Undertaker. Oh, shit, Man, I it, was, it. It, was, it was actually crazy. It, if you, if you're bored. No, I'm going YouTube that. The dog, it'll give you. I felt like a little boy yeah. while, again watching this this scene unfold. It was incredible. Yeah. Did they look? Did they still look athletic though? Yeah. Oh, geez. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, dude. Even Undertaker, who's like 70 years old. Dude, <laughs> Undertaker appeared in the ring. The bell rang, you know. Doom, doom. Lights went. Every time I talk to people about Taylor Brands, they ask, why should I get an LC through a third party? Can't I do it just all by myself? Of course, the company wants to make a profit, but that's the beauty about Taylor Brands. No. Lights went out. <laughs> Lights come on. He's standing behind the rock. That's sick. Choke slams him. Lights go out, lights go back on, the rock and him are gone. That's fire. He was there for 60 seconds. <laughs> that's Fam, incredible. We were freaking out. That's insane. Yeah, man. It's this that's that's that nostalgia. That's yeah, that which bro. by the way is why you get I the play gun? Like no buying it to get it yet. I'm probably gonna back, hop on like, there in a minute though. Nostalgia for me is that's like a drug. The, it's it's one of the things that makes me feel still. I'm so numb to shit now, dude. Why? Did you know everything? Dopamine overdose. I know everything. I've just done a lot of stuff. Dopamine overdose. See, I don't want to get to that point. You did. You're going you to. will. You will. You don't want to get to that point. You've been with too many girls, and that was messes you up. Bro, that, is, that is true. What are you talking about? That is true. That, that, that was bro, I have up. a pregnant wife. He's red pill. He's red pill. He's yeah, right. 100%. He's right. That's so why I got to limit your... <laughs> Your Girl. dopamine, all no, but it's not just girls. It's all of it. Every time you're in a box watching Undertaker on a jet, watching explosions, all that stuff, everything's so a dopamine. So you're saying that's harming you? Yes, because think about the people that were at WrestleMania last night. They all looked forward to that for, for the full year. Every day they were like, WrestleMania is six months away, five that months sucks. away. Four. No, no, it's it's great because for us, every weekend's WrestleMania in some way, shape, or form. You're in this place. You're at F1. Like, you're at like, this. Like bro, you're bro. at the Grammys. You're on, at this. Of, on the plane here, we saw the solar eclipse from 40,000 feet in the air. It's fire. We just happened. So sick. We intentionally did it, so it intersected it. But like, bro, that's a, that's a once in a lifetime event. I mean, why not take advantage of it? Yeah. Imagine him in the cockpit yelling at the pilot. Turn the plane around. Do a 360. We want to be in the to we want to see the totality. It's all totality, bro. <clears throat> and he did it. Yeah. yeah. Damn. Because he was threatening. I'm gonna have violence. to pull that off one time. Just turn this shit around. Just when's the see next if one? I got that power. Huh? When's the next <laughs> eclipse? Oh yeah. <laughs> so solar e solar eclipse is a different, you know, scientific term. You gotta wait for the XY for the 341 pi. So in around about 25.8 25.87 years, it'll be the next one. And what what causes it? It'll be in the South America though, since the equator changes from each year. <laughs> so. <laughs> What? I'm, I'm, I'm like speaking fast. You be speaking all fast, and then you say a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> no, I'm saying for real, like, cause the equator changes. The moon, main, the moon has four phases, but the moon what changes the what causes the solar eclipse is the phase three of the moon. So the phase three of the moon and the sun collided and began. So it causes the whole the whole North America equator. Then yeah, for the West to all become dark. So in the next 25.87 years, there'll be another one. Is that the inter from Interstellar? Yeah, from Interstellar. You, you ever watch Interstellar? I did. Yeah. So you remember when he was stuck in the library and it was and he was telling his daughter, mm -hmm. he was it's it's all a three dimensional world. We live in a three dimensional world, and that gives hints to the next solar eclipse. Like Matt is giving us clues each and every time. So we live in the past, but the future is the past. <laughs> I understand you. Yeah, like I, yeah, you just gotta really. Did you just call him Matt? <laughs> you want a first name basis? Matt McConaughey. <laughs> you got you got favorite movies, Katie? Interstellar probably is one. Yeah, see, see, yeah, see, yeah, he's yeah, like, yeah, right, see, he right. see he gets it. Interstellar right. or Inception? Interstellar. Yeah, Inception's Same with hard him. though. Interstellar's a top three for me as well. Yeah. That movie's crazy. What are your big three movies? If big three. Oh bro, it's hard. It's always hard. So the many big are the worst. You ever watch Truman Show? No, just great movie. I want this great movie. That's what I want to say. That's one of my favorite. <laughs> Truman, yeah, it's my favorite. <laughs> Actually, yeah, Truman. Uh, Goodfellas. <laughs> Go, okay. Come on, that's a great movie. Classic. Um, Friday. Okay. Classic. Cliche. How, bro? Friday. I mean, like everybody watches. Black. 
uh, 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 home classic, bro. Yeah, yeah. That's a hood classic. Nostalgia. Yeah, exactly. I feel like it's like what classic. Like every, like I watched that a thousand times. No, you Everybody. haven't. No, you haven't. I have. No, you haven't. <laughs> Smokey. No, you haven't. Ice Cube. Then you can go like Boys in the Hood. I mean, it's so many, bro. Yeah. What would you say your favorite? Minor, At the, uh, right now, when you just think about movies right now, what's your favorite? Well, what's, what's the three you think about right now? <laughs> Sicar got a list. Sicario. Which one? Uh, number one only. Right. Number two is kind of trash. Yeah. Uh, no Country for Old Men. Ins oh. Insane movie. And then probably it, it, it could teeter totter either The Departed or Fight Club. Probably The Departed, just because of the all star cast. I like Fight Club too, though. Fight Club's crazy. No Country for Old Men. Was no Country for Old Men could potentially be the best movie ever. He literally made. scared the shit out of me. He, they, yeah. How they described Javier Bardem's role is the closest to a psychopath yeah. in the history of, of uh, storytelling. Yeah, I think he's a psychopath every time I see him now from now on. When you actually see him in yeah. real life? Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen him in person. Right, right. <laughs> right. He, he shows up to your game in, in character. <laughs> no, now he plays like complete. He plays like other roles. Like but a like nice, whenever. Nice guy or... Yeah, yeah. But whenever you see him, you think of him with that sawed off shotgun with the silencer on the end oh of it. Gosh. Or the or the, the, fucking, the tank. What was that? The hydraulic the tank. air tank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You got to watch that. Nah, yeah. Nah. Yeah, I watched Dumb and Dumber. That movie was funny. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That was funny. It, it was is funny. a great movie. It's a great movie. <laughs> KD, uh, when celebs come into your game, are you ever distracted by people in the stands? E even just heckle hecklers, people fucking with you. I wouldn't say distracted, but I do acknowledge them sometimes, especially if it's if baddies in the stands, for sure. Yo, for real? If it's celebs around the floor, you definitely want to see who it is and, you know, see if you can, you know, politic. So would you be nervous oh, if I went to your game? I wouldn't even know you were there. <laughs> <laughs> who, who's someone that you'd notice and rec be like, oh, that's cool, they're here? Corinna Cop. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I've seen her before at a Drake concert. Uh, yeah. Um, Rih I, when, I, when Rihanna walks in, it's hard not to know Hell her. Yeah. Hell yeah. Um, just all the baddies, bro. Okay, but are you ever worried that they look good from far, but they're far from good? No, nah, I don't. Nah. Because they wouldn't come outside. Because he never gets that far. He doesn't not like with girls. Like. No, no, I'm not what? talking about Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Talk about distance, like you know, he's on the court. proximity. He's, yeah, yeah, proximity. yeah. Like they're in the stands, you know, a couple rows up, and you're like, oh, she looks good. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But oh. then you get closer, you're like, oh shit. Oh, that. Oh, I thought you meant like farther. Like they look good, but they're inside. They're bad. That's that is what I thought you meant. Is it, okay. He, you, I think you're just too elevated for this. Yeah, I don't. You're, I don't think you're behind. Above, I think you're above. Yeah, you're you're above. Yeah, for shit right now, bro. Ahead of talking about how they feel inside. No, because. No, because a girl can look very beautiful. He was saying they look good afar, but no. when you go close to them, they look bad. You yeah, know? Yeah, so he basically, yeah. it's, it's like an analogy. When you go. <laughs> How many equations you going to use today, bro? <laughs> Speed, you're, you're, you're too smart. Yes, that's, yeah. that's the yes, problem. I know. And I think he doesn't comprehend. Like I'm saying. No, he does. Uh, I'm just, giving formulas and math. That's but, just a Gen X. What, what is it, Gen Alpha? No, he, yeah, he's oh, Gen yeah, Alpha. Be, you might be Alpha. Gen Alpha. You might be yeah, Alpha. I just dude. think y'all know it all because y'all got the computer. And, 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 you know, you grew up with an iPad. Bro. Stop. You're a, pet, you're a tablet, baby. Oh, what a, yeah, tablet. I ain't experienced nothing yet. I experienced a lot of stuff. What's what's the first program you edited on? A program? Yeah, program. You edit? Uh, no, I don't edit. What do you? How do you get famous, dude? I stream. You don't edit when you yeah, stream. You don't okay, okay, shit. okay. Yeah. So you don't cut none of that stuff up and throw it on YouTube? You no. Or team. you just put the whole thing out there? I just stream like it's live. Hey, you know? hey, but, hey, but, hey. So people, if I wanted to watch it back, I couldn't go. Better designs make more profit when it comes to print on demand, and now you can make pro quality. Yeah, you could. It's live, but. but you know, I, yeah, there's. I have two channels. I have somebody editing my streams and make it to a video. Oh, so. Hey, so why don't you have a profile picture on Instagram? <laughs> because I never had one, and I don't want to do it. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. How many followers you got now? Uh, I think 15.9. 59. Right you just, you, you just said 59. Yeah. Huh? Huh? 15.9 million? Yeah. Yeah. Bro, oh, he's, yo, no, no, yo, no, no, he's no, a phenom. No, he's, 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 oh, he's crazy. I know. How many this, uh, I'm at 27. <laughs> 27 but I've been oh, come on. <laughs> Bro, I. Bro, you haven't your shit ain't turned up since like you've been doing all of this shit. Wisdom and shit to the podcast and just questions. Are you? Are you? Come on. No, I have like two, one point seven or something. Stay with your chest out, bro. Millions, bro. You hit the million. Yeah, bro. Bro, this video of him getting RKO by Randy Orton hit one hundred fifty million views in less than twenty four hours. I've, I've speed. I've never seen those numbers. Insane. Ever. That's crazy. Yeah, it was crazy. Are they RKO? bots? Bro, that's tough. Yeah. Are they fake? 
Where, who are these people? 150 million people, bro. That's a. I don't know, bro. I don't of know. Population. I don't know. I can't explain that. He's that guy, right? Currently, potentially, he's that guy. potentially. Right? Yeah, he, he really is. Yeah. Wait, do you follow uh, <clears throat> football, also known in America as soccer? Sometimes. Who would you say is the goat of uh, football? Ronaldo. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come on. See, he knows, bro. He knows. Bro, not to keep bringing this back up, but before you got RKO by Randy Orton, somehow managed to squeal out Ronaldo better. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. It was, it was just yo, an instinct. Yo, what? <laughs> I just no, said they're that. completely unrelated <laughs> in any no, way. No, just like why? Like why? Well, it's his brand. It's part, it's part of his brand. I don't know. I just instinct. Your, I don't inst know. your instinct was to scream back at Randy Orton, Ronaldo, better while he's barking at you. What drew you to Ronaldo? Huh? Why you why you love Ronaldo so much? Because like he inspired me to become great. You know, when I was around 16, 17. You know. What's he, what's up? You met him? Huh? Yeah, I met him. Oh, uh, this year video actually. Yeah, yeah. I so did him. 250 million other yeah, people. Did you that, wild yeah. out? Did you like really fan out and like almost? Yeah, was that real? Yeah, bro. Like, I, it was. It didn't seem real. Like, it felt like it was like, you know, like I don't know. It, were you Were you nervous before you met him? What do you mean? Was I nervous like, before? With your heart, with your heart beating fast. Before? Yeah, it was being dumb fast, bro. I was like on three X a drilling. Like, I didn't. Like I said, that was probably one of my best. That that is the best moment of my life. That's and the second that's one is crazy. making a million subs. But that yeah, that's the best moment of my life. That moment right there when I met Ronaldo. Do you have anybody in your life that would have that type of impact or had that type of impact that when you met him, you had that that moment? Me. When he met me, he was like. <laughs> 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 nah, man. Hell no. Nah. Nah. Nobody. I respect people. Yeah. But not to not like fanned out like that. Right. <laughs> you always been like that? Yeah. Yeah. I guess so. Some people just don't get starstruck. I don't. I was. Uh, I'm like excited to see some of these people. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm you saying, respect yeah, them. Yeah, because I respect them. Yeah. I see they work and shit, but it don't go past that. What about what about what about girls? Like, come on. There's there had to have been a girl that you thought was like bad as hell, like a Rihanna, who yeah. shows up and you're like kind of stuttering a little bit. No, nah, hell no. Nothing, huh? Mm -hmm. Smooth. No, nah, if anything, if I know I'm nervous around some a girl or something, I just stay quiet until I gather my words, bro. I don't try to Smart, do too much. Man. Sharp. Yeah, yeah. Mysterious, say less. Yeah, yeah. Type of stuff. Less is more. Do you are you following Nicole uh and Kendrick <clears throat> stuff? <clears throat> yeah. What do you think about all that's transpired? What do you think about Cole having a little like reverse moment after dropping the uh seven minute drill? Yeah, I didn't yeah. I didn't think that would happen. Him was, rolling back on it. Yeah, I thought he was. I thought he was standing on what he said. Business. And they have a little sparring session, which what it is. I don't think it's anything bigger than just like I'm better rapper than you. Like it's not nothing personal. I don't feel like so. I didn't think it needed to go that far. Do you think like cause cause Jay cause Cole is like he he does like a lot of community stuff. Like he's kind of off the grid. Like you know, focused on like family and just building and stuff. They all like, three are. Nah, but I, I just mean like, do you think he had a, a, a quick relapse and got brought back to that type of, you know, hip hop beef drama moment and then just had a realization like, yo, I don't want to be here anymore? Maybe, maybe, maybe it was, maybe it was a lot, a lot of noise around, you know, that little, well, I guess that beef, I mean, they all friends, they all know each other. So I'm sure it was a little weird, but to, as a fan of the rap of the rap game, I didn't think it was too crazy what, what was going on. I just thought it was just three great artists trying to stake their claim as the best. Did it hurt you to see that, to, to see him apologize? I wouldn't say it hurt me. <laughs> no, not sorry, not hurt. Like, sorry, <laughs> as, a, as a hip hop, as a hip hop fan. As a, as a, yeah, as <laughs> like going back to, to yeah. Ether and, and, and even back to Pocket. It was surprising because you know? I haven't, I didn't, I haven't seen that before in those situations. Right. But, Cole is just, he's untouchable as far as like talent. Ta and, lyrical and, talent. Like everything he does is like, so. What do you think Drake's gonna do? I don't know. You never know what he does, bro. He's just one of those stealth, like under the radar dudes that just pop up out of nowhere and just. <laughs> some crazy shit. Yeah, he, but other... he also just let some shit ride for five or six years before he say something. You never know with him. He don't really have to respond either too. Cause he's, do you think he's like kind of currently solidified as like, numbers wise scoreboard wise as like the go of of the space yeah um yeah but i also feel like he's competitive too and he likes that little he like he likes to rap yeah you know what i'm saying and he likes to he likes that little that lyrical sparring session 
regardless of who it is, over his whole career, you haven't seen it. So you never know what he's going to do with it, man. That's the that's the beauty of it, though, because you never knew what Kendrick was going to do when he popped out like that. <laughs> Cold came out of nowhere and dropped a fucking album in the middle of the night. Like these dudes are unpredictable. Yeah. That's the crazy part. Actually, about it. I feel though, for Drake, it's got to be worth his time and energy. Like he understands how oh, precious this, that this is. is. You know, because this is. It's, well, I'm not saying this, I'm not saying this yeah. was not right, but, right. but like, I don't, I don't, I don't actually think Drake would get into like a sparring session. I think he would go to like a fight with ten ounce gloves on. <laughs> To, to kill somebody. No, I mean, you're going to try to whoop somebody ass in a sparring session too, but after it's not a real fight at the end of the day. You're going to go home and you still know this dude. Like, yeah, after yeah, it's over, true. is that's it true. like, but, but like, okay, who knows no. who could come from there? You also, you also spar dudes and they end up fucking fighting them next month. Like, who knows? Well, Drake, tra Drake trains. Like, Drake trains with Hino, right? Or was training with Hino. You're talking so, about yeah. actually sparring? No, bro. I'm talking about. No, but you were talking about. No, I wasn't. I was talking, talking about, about like, so lyrically. Lyrical sparring. sparring? Yeah. Like, when Drake had that thing with. Oh, you're um, talking about gloves and all that shit. No, like, yeah, really that's an analogy. analogy yeah, all right. But well, what's, an what's the analogy? Do what's we need speed to explain to you what that analogy was? What's going on? Don't worry about it. Um, no, 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 when, 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 Drake, gloves had to do no, when Drake had his thing with Pusha T, yep. I remember, like, we were all waiting for the response, and then his final decision was no response, which was, by the way, the right decision, not worth the time or energy. Look where they ended up, like, right? One of one decision puts the guy on the map for a while. Who, Pusha T? There nah, I think, I think if Drake had responded and, and done a proper diss track, now it's like a thing. By not responding, that to me is like a power move. I just think he was, I mean, he had dropped the album right after that too. So I'm sure it was a lot of lines in there directed. Drake, Drake drops yeah, a lot yeah, of there was, there were, there was he, drinks, he drops a lot of subliminals too that are like known. He says known. what he he says, he speaks his mind every time he drops music. And he drops music fucking two, three times a year sometimes. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> so it's like, even if it's not a direct response in a diss record or anything like that, he's gonna tell you how he feel whenever he drops. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Are you tight with these guys? Yeah, yeah, I know these guys. Do you ever kick it though? I feel like personally, I'm bad at hanging out. No, I kick it. I kick it. I kick it, kick it when I can. You do? Yeah. I Would you want it. a two man with me? What does that mean? <laughs> like a two man? Oh, I would like, not. I would not bring anyone. With Riverside, I didn't just find a recording platform. I found a way to make my dreams of professional quality podcasts a reality. Women around you. <laughs> what? Nah, I'm good with women. And, I know they like. And, 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 I got good ribs, bro. And they, and they fresh. <laughs> I never met them before. And their first entry point to me is with you. <laughs> I got ribs, bro. Trust me. I'm not rocking. <laughs> Could you see him at Hyde? At Hyde? Hell no. <laughs> Hyde. What's, where does that? Yeah. Yeah. L. A. We we could probably go tonight if you wanted. To. Mm. Have you uh, planned the 21st? Huh? Have you have you thought about your 21st birthday? Yeah. What's your dream 21st look like? <clears throat> That's like two years, bro. I don't know. Not really. I mean, I'm not really focused on that right now. Birthday. Like, You're just working though. Yeah. Yeah. So you ain't thought about being 21. I mean, 21 is 21. Like, yeah, I'm 21, but. Oh, so you living like that already, huh? Yeah. Like. Oh, okay. It just comes fast bro. as shit, you know. Like, you're privileged, bro. Yeah. yeah. You've been privileged. Shit, My bro. privilege. <laughs> At 19, you doing, look what you at, at 19. Looks He's like a hard worker. Bro. Yeah. He's a hard worker. I just started yeah. young. I just got lucky and started young. That's really what it is. This starts so up, young. And I started when I was 15, so. That's you got a long crazy. time to keep going, bro. I'm That's crazy, good, bro. bro. Yeah. Do you think you could beat Adam Sandler at basketball? <laughs> That's a better question for you. <laughs> you, are, you are Adam Sandler. You feel absolutely like not. That dude is. That dude spends a lot of time on the courts. Yeah, he could ball. A ton. <laughs> He's it out there like every he's just day. passing though. It don't look like he, he does like a lot scores. of assists. I think he's after the assist title. That's why. Yeah. Yeah. Can you play? Absolutely not. No, he can't walk. I can't even move. I have a bad. My ankle's can't, ruined. Can't walk. Can't. Can you stairs. shoot though? Like, can you? You know. He, I did a uh, crew league okay. shootout the other day, and my goal was to to, to win fifty Gs. Would have been twenty one threes, and I did hit four. That's not good. It wasn't good. It was not good at all. You following Bronny at all? Yeah. You excited for his uh his upcoming career? Yeah, I want to see what he does next. <clears throat> cool, right? They said he's coming out. He uh, entered the draft, and then he and then he might transfer if he don't if you don't want to stay in the draft and shit. So, I think he could use another year of college and see where he at. Yeah, yeah. That father son legacy in the NBA, it's crazy man. It's seeing so many of these dudes. I'm playing against dudes whose sons. No way. You know what I'm saying? That are about to come into the league and shit. That's crazy. Carlos Boozer. Nuts. And Gilbert Arenas. <clears throat> Man, playing with your son has got to be the coolest thing ever. 
That's got to be on your radar, huh? No. Make a baby? A baby? Yeah, eventually. Uh, yeah, eventually, yeah, but not not the, the hooping on the same court. Yeah, if you, nah, yeah. Would you ever, well, yeah, I don't think that's going to happen because then you would be. Nah, that would be, that'd be <laughs> insane. Would be I could still be able to do something at 55. 53, maybe? 50, Are you, 50, 56. You still trying to be playing it? I want to still be able to move around at 56. I don't yeah. want to be a lazy ass 50 year old. Yeah, right? Just yeah, yeah, yeah. Quit being athletic and shit. Well, what would you what will you do after in your fifties? Business? Yeah, because we have a bu- we have a business partner of yours here today. Yeah, we should talk about business. No, you. Hey, where is you, he? You, he's you, gone? You, no, he's he's, he's, he's here. here, he's here. Oh. You you uh you are business savvy. You make the right investments. We see you. Some crypto stuff. Some NFT stuff. We got everybody got a nice team, man. We got teams around. This, yeah, bro. facts, facts, facts. But a lot of people don't take advantage of it yeah. or put the right people in place. Right. And that's really what it is. It's Especially if you're making the kind of money you do or like, I, like you know, any of us except Mike do. Like, you got to be able to <laughs> diversify strategically. <laughs> well, he just Mike be, doesn't need a team yet. Nah, no, he, he needs Bro, a team. that's why I don't have money is because I don't have a team, bro. I've been doing this shit for seven years. I made fucking 12 grand so far off the show. Total. That's crazy. Total. You don't own 400 some IP? Episodes. I don't own shit. It's crazy. I own a house, yeah, yeah, in, house. I own a house in LA, a four and a half million dollar house in LA that's now worth like three six. That's my grand investment, bro. Would you be interested in purchasing value. that by any chance? How to drop the Because the fucking, I bought it. The, I bought, when I buy, that means we're at the height. Yeah, same. Like when I buy, that means. Everybody get out, bro, yeah. immediately. Yeah. I mark the high of any market. Housing, stock, it doesn't Same. matter. As soon yeah. as I buy something, get out. Same. I bought an I bought an NFT for six hundred and thirty five thousand dollars. It's worth like ten. What? Ten dollars. Ten dollars. These niggas is talking about money like this shit is nothing, bro. <laughs> See, my house drop wasn't that bad. Bro, that was, that was bro bad. like bro, why can't I just sit in front of a- niggas talking about million billion dollar houses? Million dollar houses. Niggas talking about contracts. A fucking computer and make a dumb decision like that with no one watching. I, I can't lie. I thought NFTs was going to actually do something too. I think I think we all did. It's about Bitcoin. That's coming back. Yeah, that's yeah, been a yeah. good, been a good year. But every fucking time we come back, they always say it's going to hit two hundred thousand. Every time, a million. Come on. A million? <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, man. Nah. <laughs> Uh, are you interested in anything specifically like stuff you like to invest in example i like to invest in dinosaur bones but like clay collectibles the fuck and pokemon cards dinosaur bones? A, i have a triceratops they sell they like selling those yeah because it's an art piece think about it someone walks in your house as a triceratops t-rex too. the whole skeleton just the uh just the skull i have oh shit tell me the name it's an alternative investment his name is dudley and it's uh, it's great investment for you. Yeah, 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 it for sure. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna appreciate. Kind of slow. That particular market isn't like a Bitcoin, but like, is there anything you like to like have a passion for to invest in or just listen sports to sports team, teams, make money? Mmm. Mm. We invest in like pickleball. Pickle. Cool, cool. Um, uh, women's soccer league, MLS too. Yep. Oh, sick. Both of those leagues. Fucking okay, uh, you're on. volleyball league. Yeah, finger on the pulse. Yeah, I'm trying to stay in the sports sports arenas, man. Because pickleball's gonna come up. It is. Dude's like Michael. I'm Ruben seeing it on ESPN. Like, play pickleball. I'm seeing it on top ten countdown best it, plays and shit. Don't you? Yeah, hell yeah, dude. They, they get fucking crazy. Yeah, man. Pickleball. You play? But, all right, no, no, you are doing a weird. No, thing. just what? I'm just to the right a little bit, bro. Yeah, you, you, you yeah, but my mic's right here, so I'm just like my ear some shit. Nah, I'm, I won't, I won't, I won't. I only do that if you say the wrong thing, you know. Like Messi's better. Yeah. Type shit. Yeah. No, I don't, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Katie, you got to go, bro. You got a hard out. Uh, you got a hard out. You got a hard out 27 minutes ago. You gave us a lot of time. Oh, bro, today, I like bro. talking to y'all, man. I appreciate it, again. I appreciate you, man. Oh, Who man. kicked him out? He, he didn't say nothing. Oh, fair enough. All right. I, I, did, I got the five minutes. All right. Five all minutes right. ago. Uh, dude, you're amazing, man. Thank you for the time. Man, this is <laughs> happy to be a part of the team. <laughs> Elbows, bro. Nah, I'd be my know. me today. I, I was on the plane. That residue. <laughs> you went to the prior. bathroom for like twenty minutes. <laughs> no, I know oh, I didn't. Yeah, yeah, I was, yeah, yeah, I was taking a shit. Appreciate, <laughs> you, appreciate bro. you, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, Kevin Durant. <laughs> nice, nice. Why am I the only one? <laughs> Why did you? Because you just said this.